we know after the past couple months that your below the belt grooming is taken care of, but let's be honest, I'm guilty of this as well. We've been neglecting what's going on up top. So that's where today's sponsor, Harry's, comes in. Harry's gets you that clean shave feeling without having to pay for overpriced razors that are gonna go dull quickly. I've honestly been using Harry's since I started shaving, so I was stoked to have the opportunity to work with them. Harry's razors have a flex hinge that contours to your face, as well as a precision trimmer blade that gets in those hard to reach places like underneath your nose. The best part is, is that you don't have to go to the store to get new blades. They make it extremely easy to get razor refills delivered straight to your doorstep every few weeks. And Harry's just released their sharpest blades ever and they're still just $2. Get this entire trial set for $3 when you go to harrys.com forward slash TV or hit the first link in our description. So take care of yourself and your wallet this year, as well as help Harry support great causes as they give 1% of their entire global sales to nonprofit organizations that provide mental health care to men in need. So for just $3, it's a steal. And thank you, Harry's, for sponsoring today's video. We're out at the track right now. There's a group of seven dudes that came up from Iowa to ride here. The riding mecca of the world, dude. Yeah, so Ben said, one of you guys gotta hit the smart car jump. You can't pull up to the shop and, uh, Flex that you've been hitting jumps all day and then not hit the smart car jump. Did we get verbal consent that they won't sue? Yeah! Perfect clearance. He's like, I got oh, whoa! Oh! oh! That was actually pretty good. Yeah, that was pretty good. Track on the other side. Track? So I backed up that little bit. Of dude, are you trying to say track tap and you Track tap, dude. I couldn't say, I couldn't think of it. All right, Woo! we'll see you guys in Iowa. Later, from Iowa. They came up from Iowa and they said, yeah, we got eight inches yesterday right when we left. I'm like, you, you should have stayed. We got two. All right, boys, we got something weird for you today. <laughs> this is an exosled. I don't think I've ever seen one in real life. No. I and I consider not. myself a snowmobile guy. Oh, it's blue. blue. Thanks guys. Hope to ride with you. Cheers, Dave. So Dave from Exosled, who started Exosled, sent us this whole thing for free. He's like, I really want you guys to try it and just give me your honest opinion on it. So I don't know if he planned us to have it on a race sled, but it's gonna be pretty sick. We still have not ran a drop of fuel in this snowmobile. So not only will it be getting its first ride this weekend, but it's gonna be getting its first ride with the Exosled on it. I don't even know what I'm looking at. Dude, did you get instruction manual? Ken, if I recall, you said instructions are for pussies. Holy shit. Holy crap. What did we get our That's a lot of directions. Here's something. What do I look? Go. Oh. <laughs> we also kind of forgot to mention we are giving away this Polaris 600R. All you gotta do to get entered is go to cboystv.com and every $5 you spend gets you one entry. Anyways, let's get into the bill. Been riding, rolling, drinking, smoking. That's something I do. I've been hiding all of my emotions. That's something I do. I've been rolling around, I've been rolling around. That's something I do. I've been rolling around, I've been rolling around. That's something I do. Spirits are super low right now because we just found out that it's not gonna fit on the race sled. The way the A-arms go on to the sled are different and it's, it's not gonna work. So we're still gonna do it on a mountain sled, but it's not gonna work. So should we and do my turbo? Yeah, I'm not even sad like that we took this half apart. I'm just, kinda am. I'm just sad that we don't get to do it on this thing. Well, uh, we're gonna throw this back together and then uh, start rolling the time lapse on the, on the mountain sled. All right, let's do it. Been riding, rolling, drinking, smoking. That's something I do. I've been hiding all of my emotions. That's something I do. I've been rolling around. I've been rolling around. That's something I do. I've been rolling around. I've been rolling around. That's something I do. Okay, we're in, boys. Nice. Let's go, boys. Holy Damn, this is crap. Really freaking weird looking. Dude, this <laughs> thing's a unit. What the frick? Oh my gosh. The to top it all off, we put on the turbo sled. Like, Why didn't yeah, we do this? Oh, you can God. chill though, right? You can chill. Yeah, this is so weird. <laughs> it feels like yeah. a jet ski. You definitely could tip it over. Let me see. Let me see. Holy crap. Dude, I am way too hungover for this. So we can just throw these in? Yeah, I mean, we don't need them. <laughs> I still need these. <laughs> <laughs> we're just committed now, we're like, oh, he's 
never going back. <laughs> Give some context to this. We convinced CJ that it's not cool to put aftermarket skis on your sled, and he just believes it. It's a total joke, but he's just like, oh shit. <laughs> Dude, Dude. You guys, let's take a minute to appreciate how sick he looks great. right now. <laughs> Dude, you legit look so dope. No, it actually does look really good, but it's, it's funny though. Such a bad boy look. I legit thought you were doing it as a joke. Well, I'm so happy it was easy to put them on. <laughs> like, you literally look like a racer. Yo, CJ pulls up to the starting gate and we come out with drums and we just sort of sweep off the skis. <laughs> Getting the sled ready. <laughs> <laughs> you do you want to know the best part though? Is like, I'd at least be able to enter the track in my GPS system. Not just follow that. <laughs> no, but seriously, dude, you look sick. We have a lot of snow, this should be easy. <laughs> Look at all that snow we've got on CJ's car. I was gonna push it over, but I wanna bend my bars right from the start. Ryan, you riding your turbo sled today is like buttering a, a piece of toast with a sword. Yeah, might be a little bit of overkill. So one of my favorite things to do while Ken's gone is uh, call random people uh, through his GPS. Oh my God. All right. Should we just drag it out? I saw what you were doing. What? Who else did you call? What are you talking about? It looks like I'm like coming out for a WWE match right now. <laughs> <laughs> watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out! You know, like a bicycle where you need speed to not tip over. Yeah, I don't really know how this is gonna freaking work. Hopefully, I don't die. What do you think is gonna happen? Alrighty. Well, me Turbo turnouts with one ski in the air. Oh, oh, okay. It looks like it'd be fun as if there was like five feet of snow. A lot more stable than you think. Like you lean it over, you feel like you're just gonna fall, but it just hangs. Yeah, I've dropped the foot. Oh. It's dope! <laughs> Let me try. It's like cool, like it looks cool. I don't know, I don't even know what to think. Oh! <laughs> yeah. It's like you're boondocking. Yeah, it does, yeah. but there's no snow. Like, yeah, you know, that's I feel like true. it'd be a blast in a lot of snow. I agree. Oh man, I agree I'm completely. so excited. Dude. Timber sled vibes. With the power. Timber sled in a field, but you have power. I wonder how it is in like, on a hill. You just cut it, you know? There's yeah. no even like sidling, you just go up. Yeah, let's go dish bang it. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha 
That was sick, dude. That was really good. You look good and you ride even better. I'm trying to show you the bottom of my skis. Those things are sick, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I was a little scared. Ah, the kill switch! Dude, this thing still is just as goofy as when we first put it on. Like, it doesn't make sense. We didn't have enough snow, but I just gotta say a big thank you to Dave at Exoslat. I'm pretty sure he's the one who engineered this thing. It's pretty interesting, and I'm glad we got to be a part of the Pioneer sport, I guess. Also, we're creeping up on one milli. I think we're like 25K away, which is insane. So help us get there. Uh, but we love and appreciate you guys. We'll see you in the next I've been riding, rolling, drinking, smoking. That's something I do. And uh, drop a like for CJ's new skis. Been hiding all of my emotions. That's something I do. Whoa! <laughs> oh, 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 the plane! <laughs> <laughs>